They're also staying on top of a major problem in Hillcrest where a broken water main flooded and undermined the road at a busy intersection just a few hours ago. Happened at 5th and Pennsylvania and has impacted a lot of businesses in the area. 10 News reporter Maria Arcegadan has been covering this story since 5 o'clock. She is joining us now with the situation ongoing. Maria? Well, businesses within a five block radius have been affected. Take a look behind me. This entire area has been closed down after a 20 inch water main broke right in front of that restaurant. Businesses won't have water here for at least 20 hours, we're being told. But the good news is they do plan to open Pennsylvania and one lane of fifth and they'll reopen it to traffic. And all of a sudden you could literally hear and see the pipes burst and little water coming out of the cracks. Sky 10 video shows the river of water flooding Hillcrest. Saturated streets began to buckle and businesses were forced to close all along Fifth Avenue. My whole patio was flooded of with was flooded. The owner of Huapango's Mexican restaurant heard her customers screaming. Yes. Customers are scared. They were sitting in a patio. This <laughs> is this is cell phone video. The owner shot of the water rushing through their outdoor patio. The broken water main was located right in front of her business. I ran out and I saw the street going up and the water coming and I got really scared. I thought it was an earthquake. The city says a 20 inch cast iron pipe installed in 1907 is to blame. We'll be bringing in some heavy equipment, a backhoe. We'll be uh, excavating the area. And it could be quite some time before businesses are back up and running. Unfortunately, it looks like uh, they will not have water service until sometime late tomorrow. Um, for restaurants, uh, County Health will not allow them to be open during that time. You can see the crews out here tonight. They are digging up that roadway to replace that 20 inch pipe that was installed in 1907. They tell us 20 hours at least before water is turned on. A lot of people around here, not only just the businesses, but the residents in this area are very concerned that they're not going to have any water for cooking or for showering or doing all kinds of things. But once again, they tell us that they don't want to ruin the traffic in this area or slow it down. They're going to reopen Pennsylvania and one lane of fifth once they get that area and that pipe replaced. Reporting live in Hillcrest, Maria Arcega done 10 News.